So I've been holding off doing this video because it didn't feel right when we were getting development after development on the Ark Pass to make a video kind of in the middle of it. In the last week we've had the world boss exploit get patched, gold reduced, and then we also had the Ark Pass get completely disabled because they're going to be working on new quests or a different way of actually earning Ark Pass rewards. And I for one are very happy that it's actually been disabled because it means I have to do 16 less dailies or 100 less weekly. It also means you either have to have a good proficiency of a profession or just good knowledge of the game to make money rather than just killing a few mobs and getting 5 or 10 G thrown your way. But to be honest, I'm really hoping that we don't have any more dailies or any more quests that involve just kind of going out of your way to complete them in the Ark Pass, like at all. I honestly hope they go back to how it used to be, sorry for the crude calendar, but it used to be that you'd get a login reward every day that you logged in. And if I remember right, you used to get a extra bonus for logging in for 7, 14, 21 and 28 days, and that was kind of a good system for when we had Patreon. And yep, I know that people are going to say, well, it's meant to be a monetization model. Surely that wouldn't be the premium thing. No, I suppose they could add XP based progression in the Ark Pass because people want to be able to do whatever they want in the game. And most stuff that you want to do in the game gives XP. So they could just make it really easy, simple. Every level of the Ark Pass is a set amount of XP and X amount of XP you level it up. Simple as that. And then just make it so that the more levels in the Ark Pass you have, the more XP is required to actually get to the next level. For me that's a rather simplistic but easy way to fix the Ark Pass because then it's not going to be, you know, 50 people level 30 running around gaining 500 gold a character. I really hope that the next iteration we get gives no gold because it just, it just devalues everything in the game. Now on the stream yesterday they did mention that they were going to be going away talking to Excel to work on the Ark Pass. They also mentioned that they're going to be working on iterations of the Grace Period. They are currently testing the Grace Period in-house at the moment and they said that it is working so far. And I really hope that we do get it soon because there are quite a lot of random crashes I've been getting. At one point I logged on, made a portal to Cairnord, crashed when I got in the portal, had to queue again. And just overall it would be nice so that if you did get disconnected by the gods or you did get a crash or something like that, you can just jump back in rather than have to wait at peak times, potentially a few hours if not longer. So I think due to the Ark Pass issues, that may be getting a backseat, but due to them having a version of it already existing, hopefully if that works perfectly, that can just be slapped on. And the last thing I want to talk about is people asking constantly for new servers. The only thing that's going to do is attract people who are maybe less geared on the popular servers and they'll migrate from the other servers onto the new one. Those other servers will still be kind of strong, but the ones they've just joined will probably die pretty quick. Because if a new server opened up for me and I had the option to join it, but I'd have to leave my character behind that I've just spent what, the best part of a week or two leveling up? I don't want to do that. It's a long grind to get to that point. And my philosophy on arcade servers, due to my experience in the past, is the more you have, the quicker they'll merge. And it just makes it kind of pointless to have all these servers just kind of floating about. But anyway, this was kind of just a quick update video and kind of a summary of what's been happening over the last few weeks. And I hope to see you here for the next video.